So Jean-Michel, we've seen a lot of changes in the ocean since we were kids. It's amazing that uh, people our age are able to do a report, but we're talking about not even a lifetime. That's right. And Part of a lifetime. Uh, <laughs> we, uh, my opinion is that we need a wake-up call. You're here. We know where the problems are. See, we had an excuse because how can you protect what you don't understand? But now we understand. Yes, we now need what we know. needs to be done. Mm -hmm. So what are we going to do? When are we going to get up and, and really take action? Well... This is the time, and you know, divers know, probably more than most people, because they actually go into the ocean. And I had a chance to start, you had a chance to start decades ago, and have seen this more change, perhaps, in our lifetime than during all preceding history uh, in the ocean. But at the same time, we've learned more and have the opportunity to inspire the world all divers do to share the view and people need to take hold up the mirror and see what individually as well as collectively we can do to do the things that that need to be done we need to take the pressure off the wildlife in the sea we can make a personal choice not to eat bluefin tuna or for me i just don't eat any of the wild creatures in the sea they're more valuable alive swimming in the ocean than they are swimming with lemon slices and butter on our plates those are individual things, but, oh, we need to share what we know and And take others. action, and mm -hmm. take action. And I, since we are divers, you divers, mm -hmm. uh, we're the only ones who put our head below the surface. Mm -hmm. We're the only ones who can see and eventually understand and at least find the information to take action, as you say, at our individual level, and then inspire some of our decision makers, whether it's government or industries, locally, globally, to uh, be educated so they can make decisions. And uh, that is our life support system. Yeah. Every breath we take, every drop of water we drink, we're connected, even if you've never seen the ocean. But those who have seen it have a special responsibility to share the, what they know and to try to drag others in there to see for themselves too. <laughs> I, I keep telling people, you know, you don't have to be near the ocean to be concerned. Yeah. Uh, you can be on top of a mountain. When you go skiing, you're skiing on the ocean. <laughs> Next true. time you drink, take a drink of water, you're drinking the ocean. Mm -hmm. So we're all connected one way or the other. And if we damage it, if we pollute it, if we're not taking care of it, See? These guys will die. <laughs> and so will we. And so we'll go with it, obviously. But there is plenty of reason for hope. And the hope, I think, is that now we know. Now we know. And now That's right. there's still time, not a lot. But I think, truly, the next little piece of time, the next 10 years, we can take what we know, inspire people to take care of the ocean that takes care of us. But every day that passes, <laughs> we're losing ground. So we have to hurry. But this is the moment. I think we're the luckiest ever to come along because for the first time we understand that it matters what we do to the natural world. And maybe for the last time, the last best time, we still have a chance. We still have 10% of the sharks. All of That's the ocean right. is not a big dead zone, just parts of it. There's still time. We still have some coral reefs. But if we wait around and don't take action now, by the middle of the 21st century, we will have lost what we now have a chance to do. It's interesting because it reminds me of what my father said in 1972, publicly at a commission in the U.S. He said, if we don't do anything within 20, 30, 50 years, it will be too late. Well, we're in 2010. We have 12 more years if we believe what he said. That's about right. The next decade is this critical window as never before maybe it's never again we have a chance so let's get we'll busy do it. <laughs> <laughs> onward and downward and you will do it too yes <laughs>